guys, me, Adrian, make sure this guy's a real day, no more hard. Look. Okay, guys, we're gonna go inside. So we're, we're here, and, and we have to line up. Hey, that's me, Adrian, and we are the magical place. What is the magical place to see world? I got, and, and what is this in this water, guys? Do you, do you know? Maybe uh, it's a turtle or a fish? Another thing, my cute little you know, run out of the area. Uh, I will need to make you see the spot here. Okay. Okay. are highly social animals with a well-defined social structure. An orca pod is always led by a female. Though just half the size of her male counterpart, she is in charge. It's all about attitude, not size. Because they live and work as a group, orcas need to communicate with sounds and body language. Orcas use clicks and calls for group coordination and hunting. <laughs> vocal development studies here at SeaWorld show that early on, calves learn vocalization from their mothers. But as they grow, they learn from others close to them as well. This is a bottlenose dolphin call that Shuka learned and even taught other killer whales here at SeaWorld. In fact, orcas are the largest members of the dolphin family. Whales here and in the wild use vocalization to communicate all the time. and get a better view of their surroundings when they hunt. Excellent community. 
Ocean's food chain. Killer whales work together to rear their young, protect their pod, and most importantly, pursue and catch their prey. Every day they cooperate to survive in the wild oceans of the world. The orca's hunting techniques are as varied as the whales themselves. Norwegian killer whales will circle herring, herding them together. The whales use sounds to coordinate with each other and to disorient the herring. With the fish confused and contained, the whales stun them with their powerful tail flukes, making for an easy meal. Tire gear they can fit there. Okay, we're just gonna wait until the dolphin show comes.
Glowing and turn glow. It's my rifle. There we can see the fire dancing.